My mother always told me I was a lucky one. I remember perfectly her words. She told me I was always in the right place at the right time. That I was born under a lucky star. This uh, short story of Stephen King's um, concerns um, a chap, me, who uh, works in an insurance office in one of the Twin Towers in New York. One morning, which happens to be the morning of 9-11, he decides to take the day off and he doesn't go to work. I can hear her as if it were yesterday. My little Scott is a child blessed by the gods. This may have been true for a long time, but today I tell myself that Mother was wrong. Some weeks later, he suddenly finds in his room, in his bedroom, a pair of glasses that belonged to one of his colleagues who died in the attack. This is obviously um, quite shocking for him. He doesn't know what to do with them. And so, I guess in denial, he throws them away in the rubbish. But they come back and they appear in his room again. Hello. Oh, hello. I was just wondering if you'd like to have lunch with me one of these days. You do know I'm engaged, right? Yes, of course. Scott meets Sarah in the corridor of the house. He's never met her before. She's just arrived in New York from Boston. She's English, she's from London. They don't know each other at all. So what is it that you want then? Well, just to, just to talk to someone. And he has to confess to her because he needs to talk to somebody, um, some of his uh, fragility and fear that this is uh, rarely enough in a film story. Uh, contact between two uh, lead characters, which is purely on the level of uh, human feeling and compassion. And I think that's nicely drawn in this uh, script. It's been interesting and fun to play. <laughs>